This video is designed to support you to administer access arrangements for the multiplication tables check. We recommend that administrators use the Try It Out area, which opens in April, to apply the access arrangements and to ensure they meet your pupil's needs ahead of pupils taking the check in June. Access arrangements may be appropriate for pupils with an Education, Health and Care EHC plan, for whom provision is being made in school using the Special Educational Needs and Disability SEND support system, whose learning difficulty or disability significantly affects their ability to access the check, who have behavioural, emotional or social difficulties, with English as an additional language who have limited fluency in English. As a check administrator, you can enable access arrangements for pupils with specific needs. To do this, select Enable Access Arrangements for Pupils Who Need Them from your school's homepage and then select View Pupils and Assign Arrangements. Select the access arrangement required, then start typing the pupil's name into the search bar. Select the pupil, then save. It is possible for a pupil to have more than one access arrangement if required. For example, a pupil with a visual impairment may need the audio version and the audible timer alert. The following access arrangements are available. If the colour contrast feature is enabled, the pupil can change the font and background colour. There is a range of contrasts available to meet the needs of pupils with visual impairments. By enabling font size, pupils can increase or decrease the size of the text and number pad on the screen. The standard version of the check includes a three-second pause between questions. However, some pupils may have specific needs which means that this is unsuitable. A Next button can be enabled so they can proceed to the next question when ready. Please be aware that when using this access arrangement, there is a 30-minute time limit to complete the check and the time allowance of six seconds per question will be maintained. The Remove Number Pad arrangement may be useful for pupils who could either get distracted by the number pad or do not wish to use it. When activated, the pupil will only see the question and answer box on the screen. Please remember that if you activate this feature, the pupil will need to use a keyboard to input their answers. Use of the Input Assistant access arrangement will require someone to enter the answers dictated by the pupil. It is essential that the Input Assistant enters the exact answer given by the pupil, or the check will be deemed invalid. You'll be required to include the Input Assistant's name when the pupil completes the official check in June. This step is not required for the Try It Out check. The audio version may be useful for pupils with severe visual impairments or processing difficulties. Your settings. You have the following settings on your check. 1. Audio version. If you need to add or remove any settings, please tell your teacher and link. Sign out. Button. Next. A pupil can also use Tab and Shift plus Tab to navigate through the screens. The audio version will read out all text displayed on the screen, including instructions, questions and the answer input after each key press. Practice question 1. 1 times 12. 1. 2. Practice question 2. 2 times 2. 4. Practice question 3. 10 times 10. 1. 0. 0. Practice completed. Button. Next. We recommend schools administer the check to pupils who are using the audio version in a separate room or provide headphones to the pupil to avoid the audio version distracting other pupils taking the test at the same time. Please note the check does not support third-party screen readers due to the incompatibility with the timed element of the check.
Pupils with a visual impairment may need to use an audible timer alert. A beep will sound two seconds before the end of each question, then a different beep at the end of each question. We recommend pupils practice the check with access arrangements using the try it out check before taking the official check to ensure the arrangements meet their needs. If access arrangements have been enabled for a pupil, the arrangements will automatically be available to the pupil when they log in to the try it out check and the official check. Further guidance about administering the check is available on gov.uk. If you have any queries, please contact the National Curriculum Assessments Helpline.